Aloha! This is the Green Lightning Mr. T. Last episode, we did quite a bit of... What's it called? <laughs> um... Serena Beach? Something like that. And in this episode, um... I say we should mix it up. Um... Let's try Rico Harbor. Because we've only done like two in here. That's at least a bit more than Penyanta Village or whatever. The Cage Shine Sprite. Now this one can be very difficult if you're not very good at platforming. And how many shines do we have it by the way? 17. Alright. Um the route you're supposed to take, well, there really isn't a specific route you have to take. There are many ways to get up to the shine, which is in that ca yellow cage up there. But I guess the best, I don't know, is this a way you can go? That may be the direction they want to you to go? I don't know. There's many ways to get up there, but... I don't know. Confusion. I don't know what route they meant for you to take. In fact, well, I could technically look at a strategy guide in order to figure that out, but... Hmm. I don't... To, to tell the, you guys, to be honest with you, I don't know where any of my strategy guides are. Because my... Um, well, all my strategy guys are packed away somewhere, <laughs> because my house recently went through construction and, well, I don't know where anything is anymore. Which is annoying, because I have some games that are packed away that I, that I have, some, a couple of which have, I've been itching to play and, well, I don't have. So basically what the route I'm taking is just going to be the most outside route where you don't jump up anything, you just take these cranes and then you climb up these grates. I guess. <laughs> is this route a little convoluted? I think it might be the route they wanted you to take because it's following all the arrows, so to speak. And these bloopers are different from bloopers on the ground. Oh god, no, no. I, di I didn't even see this enemy on the enemy list. I forgot he existed. And rocket nozzle. Now once you get the rocket nozzle, you can head down to the bottom underneath the area and just rocket up to the shine, but uh, I'm going to keep going this way. Oh, first time I have the rocket nozzle. Boom, rocket nozzle. That's what it does. And, okay, it explained the uh, extra nozzles. There's gonna be like one, maybe even two. Nah, there's only one. Um, initial nozzle box that will unlock all the other uh, boxes. Um, but, like, the boxes won't appear until a certain level, I guess. <clears throat> it's a little different for, um... Man, I have trouble with names, don't I? Um... The Phenol Plaza. That's it. Uh, we'll get into that when the time comes. Secret of Rico Tower. Now here's where the rocket nozzle comes in handy, I guess. Right, where can I get the rocket nozzle? Uh, I'll probably just head over there. So once again... 
I don't know. <laughs> I kind of don't know how to deal with this game as playing it blind, because I never did play it blind. I'm a chuckster! Oh yeah, I... I, I love the different chucksters in this game, because every now and again you'll find a guy who's... or a woman... Um, who will be a chuckster and they'll chuck, chuck you. Like that. And basically what this guy does is each level he gets stronger. So he'll chuck you farther each time. And then his son will actually pick up chucking as well. And eventually, like, by the last level, they'll chuck you huge distances. Oh! <laughs> I, f I forgot. For some weird reason, this rock particular rocket nozzle likes to go all the way over here. <laughs> For no particular reason at all. Other, to n other than to make use of that part of the level. Am I making this game sound kind of weird? Well, I guess that's my intention, actually. <laughs> Because some of these shines are a bit convoluted. Oh. And there's part slopes in this game don't really work um, the way they should in this game. Sorry for all the stifling, by the way, if you're picking that, which Mike probably is. This mic seems to pick up everything. And there. Nope, no, oh. My gosh, I am having a lot of trouble, aren't I? Okay, we made it after a lot of struggle and actually time spent in the level, which wasn't bad. <laughs> okay, this, well, I don't know why I'm being so quiet actually. <laughs> Um, I don't really need to focus that much, do I? <laughs> so this level's got a lot of turny things, I guess, and that's the gimmick of this level. I don't know. <laughs> am I running out of things to talk about? Maybe I am. <laughs> Heck, if I even came to this with stuff to talk about. Do I patronize myself a little harshly, maybe? <laughs> when it comes to making these recordings. Oh god, camera angles make this awkward. Oh god, no, no, no. Um... This is a big one. This is definitely a big one. And that is a small one. Ugh, <sighs> made it. Okay. Okay, so maybe one more? Yeah, sure, why not? And I guess maybe back to Bianca Hills. That's right, it's Bianca Hills, not Pianta Village. <laughs> what do these strange me things mean anymore? Like, does Rico actually mean something? Does Bianca mean something? Hmm. 
Maybe I'll research that. Do a little research. Won't hurt. Alright, so... This mission, you want to head up to the helipad. Helipad in. Why don't we try to take this? So here is the guy's son. Let's see. How far will you chuck me today? <laughs> oh, he's, he's just starting. Isn't that a fun way to get to the boss? <laughs> so here's a. Okay, really? Okay, I don't. Hey, hey! I wasn't done with you. Well, that was kind of weird. Okay, what is going on with my controller? Okay, controller will operate. Oh, I screwed up. Whatever. Alright, let's just do it the way we were meant to do it, I guess. I'm not sure why he has that thing in his mouth, anyways. A little bug or whatever. There we go. Oh, really? They're making me look bad. Oh, he's making me look bad. He's making me look bad. Alright, something to note. If you need health at any point, you can just go right under here. Grab some coins. Oh, he's about to spit on me. Spit at me, actually, I think. Okay, I'm doing a horrible job. Okay, come on. Let's do the thing. Okay, so let's do the thing again. Come on. Okay, I... That's it. I'm ripping your tentacles off. You lose your arm privileges. Gosh, this is so revolting, isn't it? was poorly handled. Whatever. Maybe that Chuckster is actually like a speedrunning tactic. Huh? Right. So, 20 shines. Yep. 20 shines. So, now that we have 20 shines, we have unlocked a new level! So, forget Bianca Hills, we're going to... Um... Well, Noki Bay, actually. What the? Oh, okay, whatever. And just like in Super Mario 64, you're supposed to look, look up at the sun. Somehow that teleports you somewhere. Uncork the waterfall. So we have new goop color. Yay! Oh, no. 
Ah! Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, welcome. Master Mario, I presume? We have heard much about you. Yes, and all of it good. <laughs> oh, you heard I got arrested and stuff? <laughs> oh, wow, that's kind of sad. As for me, I am just an old man who loves nothing but fishing. But lately, I've had a terrible problem. Please, look up there. I don't know who did it, but someone corked our waterfall. This, no doubt, is why our lovely bay has become polluted. And I can't even fish. And so, I ask for your help. Yank that cork! Please fulfill this old man's wishes. <laughs> What's that? You'll do it? Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I know I can count on you. Just beware that guy on the cork. So... You know he's up there, but you don't know who corked the waterfall? Ugh. Old senile man. Uh, whatever. Alright, so basically the objective of this level is to get to the cork and uncork the waterfall. And you can spray these things to make those things appear. Yeah. Now, you can head straight to him by doing a bunch of ball jumps and ball kicks. And I, if these little ball things have names, I will find it. They may not. <laughs> By the way, do watch your water, I guess, going up here. Alright. Um, we'll get into these into more specific about these springs. Well, too late. Okay, you can pick, shrink these springs by spraying them with water, and then carry them around to where you want. Kind of neat, I guess. Oh god, no! No! <sighs> ah, dang it. Well, at least I can do this now. Oh, and I technically wasn't. <laughs> did I, I technically wall jumped this without even realizing I did it, apparently. Because <laughs> there's a pot over there you're supposed to fill up with water again, that elevator system. Or that pulley system, rather. Proper terms. I'm not sure why that constituted a spin, but okay. So, if you head all the way up here, you'll be able to get yourself a rocket nozzle. Which has no use other than this area right here, really. Although you can get a life over here, but, well, it's there if you want to use it. Did I jump that, or did I just hit it wrong? Whatever. <laughs> Apparently I just went right through them. Oh, wait, no, I have the spring for that anyways. Oh well. Okay, so this is the guy's son, by the way. The Gramps' son, or grandson, rather. Oh no, he's his teacher. Never mind, he's a student. Oh, stop confusing me! Okay. Hmm. 
So if you just use this here. Okay, let me rephrase it. If you use that here, you should be able to get yourself a one up. If I still had the other nozzle. <laughs> but I can just rock it up here. Let's get rid of this first. And it's the same drill as before. Pick up the bombs and you throw it at them. By the way, these bombs do pr supply an unlimited source of coins if you want to take forever to just throwing bombs. It doesn't have to be at him to get coins. I love how this waterfall kind of just sprays out into nothingness. Right! Shine, everyone! I gotta shine! Look, guys, I gotta shine! <laughs> yeah, alright. Well, at any rate, this has been the Green Lightning Mr. T. I hope you've enjoyed the video, and to you I say... Aloha.